Buongiorno, my friends. Buongiorno, buongiorno, bon, 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 bon. Do you feel the need to sing it every time? Uh, it's a great song. <laughs> I'm going to have to go talk to my publicist you about should. it and see if I can get some copyrights yeah. on it. Today is the day. Right now, we are driving to our final walkthrough of the house and possibly signing. I am still not going to get totally excited until, the, I, until I come back on this camera and dangle the keys in my hands. I'm nervous. Oh, by the way, we're going to change the locks first thing we're doing. Oh, yeah, obviously. I'm nervous, yet excited, yet, like, ready for this new adventure, building a new set, like, making the house our own, you know, all that stuff, like painting and decorating. I'm, I'm ready for this new journey, and I'm going to take you, well, we are going to take you along for the ride. So, um... Yeah, we're just really excited and, and I'm nervous. I don't, I don't know what to expect, but... What can you expect? I got I don't this on lockdown. I don't know. I, I've never done this before and it's, it's... I don't know. So, I'm excited. I'm very excited. Are you excited? Oh, excited. I need another cup of coffee. You do not need a I do. You really sign a piece of paper. You know how much pieces of paper I have to, I have to sign? Lot. It's, it's going to make my wrist fall off. Okay, fine. Then I need another And then I got to listen to the lawyer talk. And you know how that goes. Then I need another cup of coffee, too. You ever listen to a lawyer talk for more than 10 minutes? You'll need a cup of coffee. Okay. Oh, no, the battery's almost dead. <gasps> it's official! Wait, wait, wait! Oh, wait, this is, I'm serious, the battery's really low. The battery's really low. So, I can just show you this right here. I almost hit my head on that chandelier. Yesterday the camera died and we were really really sorry about that. There's nothing we could do about it. In fact, we brought an extra battery and it was dead as well and the charger was back at the house. So, I'll show you kind of what we did. We really didn't do much at all. We just did a, some paint in the living room. So, today we're going to be going for uh, shopping for our couches and things like that and we'll take you along for the ride. But look, Jojo, yes, dear. peek over. Say hello. I'm trying to track down the beeping screen. <laughs> He's so cute. So we're so excited. That's the color, the white color that the house came. It was just primed, uh, and we just chose our own color, and that's the color we chose. And the color we chose is from Sherwin Williams, and it's called Sandbar. Am I right, babe? I don't know. You picked it. It's Sandbar, I believe. I'll get the swatch uh, today when we go back because we have to get more paint. And I'll show you guys because I took a picture and posted it on Instagram, and uh, everyone was asking for the color, and I don't have the swatch. But uh, when we go back today to get more paint, I'll get this watch and I'll show you what it is in case you're interested. I was looking for, um, I'm very particular when it comes to things. I don't like a lot of bright colors. Joe and I are not really a big fan of dark walls. Um, I just feel like it makes the room look closed in. He feels the same way. So I was looking for a neutral color that wasn't too cool, but wasn't too warm. Because the furniture for the living room is going to be... Um, like uh it's not gonna be like brown it's gonna be uh, as warm as our furniture now which is gonna go in the basement eventually so we wanted to look for something that was very neutral and we found this we picked this color and we are so in love with it the whole house will be painted this color minus the um spare bedrooms and stuff so mm. you look in front of me that noise is driving me crazy so guys we finally did it we're so excited and we're glad, we're so happy we can take you guys along with us on the experience. This is not an official house tour, but it will be one day. So this is kind of my before shot. That is an alarm sensor I took off the wall so we could paint behind it. We did have a little mishap here with the paint. When they give you the sample at the store, the sample container. They tell you it's the same finish. Well, that, that it is the same finish, but it's not she the same quality. Me. So there's, it's the same finish and she's not wrong. It's just that when they give you a sample bucket, it's to see what the finish would look like, but it's slightly different than when you actually buy the can. So from this angle, you can so see bad. the sample can was used there, and it was used along the edges of things. So we actually have to go back and redo a lot of the paint in the living room to fix that issue. Um, we have a beautiful vineyard in the backyard, as you can see. There's a winery back there. It looks very nice. I feel like I'm in Napa Valley. And um, we are going to get uh, moving out of here to go get some supplies. We use a 16 foot ladder to get up at the top there, as you can see. However, that is the maximum height of a 16 foot ladder plus a Joe Vitale arm. And we need to get a 22 foot ladder to finish this job. So, and uh, you know, it looks kind of crazy because all the vents are off. Got to go figure out what couch we're going to get.
Oh, he has a tape measure. Joe, what are you doing over here? Oh, picking on couches. Is that is that a couch? I'm interested in this Jaguar very much. Is it a Jaguar? It doesn't so matter. It's going to protect our house. Wow. It's 50% off right now, this Jaguar. Off the regular price. Off the regular price. Yep. Look at that. It's regularly 519. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Thoughts on the Jaguar? You gotta give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Negative. Two thumbs up. Ah, oh, that's three down. Well, I, I no, you, your gears is up, so I'm giving it two thumbs up as well, so that means we're getting it. Dude, I, it was totally there. It's a nice Jaguar. It's a very nice Jaguar. Is there anything? Oh, there's one right there. Come on, Jenny. Okay. This ladder, ladder. How many feet long is that ladder? First of all, Mike and Bree, the reason for why I'm reason, for why I haven't lost my mind. This one, by the way, if you ever need a master painter, she's the one to call. That one has to go up there to do all the cutting in. I am not doing that. Uh, how's it going, babe? Uh, it's going Let's test this no, 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 no. Jo Joseph, don't even think about it. Joseph, don't even think about it. You're gonna, you cannot put the ladder on one step. Don't do that. Don't do that. Put that down. We'll figure it out, but you're not doing that. He's trying to put the ladder, the bottom of the ladder's got two feet. He's trying to put just one of the one of the feet on the steps and the other one just hangs out. Well, he's, no, he's crazy. So that's what's happening right now. It's still painting the living room since it's the biggest, kind of the biggest, most awkward room of the house. Well, the entryway is gonna be kind of a pain, but that's what we're up to. And I'm gonna go back in. All right, guys, so let me show you what, she's rathering, I don't think. So let me show you what I'm talking about. This is, this is how it works. You paint way up here, way up here. And I hope you're not afraid of heights. But this is what's happening down here. Laura and Mike are dancing. This is a ladder. This is 20 feet up off the ground. Hey, Bree. She's cutting in. I got to tell you all about what happened with Sherwin Williams today. Laura is going to tell you the story. Okay, I'm not sure. Because where's the mic on this thing? We good? I don't know, but I'm so mad. They sold us five gallons of flat paint when I specifically asked for a satin. So yesterday we painted this whole room and half of the hallway plus the office. Mike, can you shut the radio off? I don't want to get a copyright today, strike. Today, all right, you can hear what it is. Okay, good. And today, when I went to get five more gallons because I need to do a second coat, she told me, well, the system says you got flat, not satin, and I thought that's why it looks so matte in my house. Well, th that's why this morning when I showed you guys the difference. I by the was way, right. By the way, this is how we paint. It doesn't look that high from the camera. I'm gonna give you an idea. Here's here's an idea. So there's the steps over there, and the steps go up. That's called the back staircase. That's what one of the things that sold me. Wow! On the camera, you can really see the difference between the matte and the flat. So that line right there. This is all dry, all the paint's dry where you're looking. That line is the line between the finish, I meant to say between the, the satin and the flat. That's satin on the bottom and flat on the top. That's the difference in the look, and it does absolutely look different when the light hits it a certain way. So anyway, that's, that's the upstairs part. We'll show you guys at a future time. And then this is, this is, oh, there you go. You can kind of get the idea. Probably should use this other hand to hold on. Um, so, all right, I'm gonna go hold on up here. You know, the three point rule. Two feet in a hand or two fan, hands in a foot. That's that's how you're supposed to climb. That's my rule. Kept me alive all these years. Dude, it's okay. Coming out nice. Here, let me drop this down to you. Alright. Lens is out, be careful. Bye. Oh. What up everybody? Reach. <laughs> oh yeah, that's reach right there. Reach, homeboy. Yeah. Uh, okay. Let me make it out there, good? You're painting the edge of the corner there? Cutting in. Called cutting in, guys. Cutting in is where you take the, take the, um, yeah, you take your, you know, your brush. It's, a, it's called a brush. You take the brush and you get really close to edges. Like, for instance, let's do a little tutorial here. Cutting in would be 
um, when you get the brush and you go right against that edge, but you don't exactly hit the bottom there because you don't want to get the white, uh, that color, right? So, so, you, so yeah, hey, Joe, you know, you really can, you really, Joe, you really can see the uh, the difference here. Yes, there you can. The camera makes it really visible. I tell you. You can't see it in, in with the human eye, but the camera really catches it. It's crazy. We can check the whole, that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. We can actually check the room. Spot here. Right there, yep. Yeah. Yeah, so anyway, um, it's one of those things, you know, so other, other than that, it's going pretty nice, right, Joe? I think it's show? going well. Yeah. Um, I found the menu, Genevieve's. Did we find a menu for dinner? I found a menu for dinner. The area that we moved, guys, we're not really sure where we are yet. Yeah. We know there's a Wawa that's nine minutes away, one that's 11 minutes away, one that's 13 minutes away. Six minutes away. Six? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Which one? What? Oh, Duncan, Dun where's D&D. Which one? Six minutes away, bro. Woodstown. 45? Woodstown, bro. That's the one I was trying to find the other day. Yeah, we found it. Wow, wow. So it. guys, another thing we're gonna try to do here, just so you know, we're gonna stuff Laura down this down this hole. I don't know why you wanted me to go down that hole Wait, so bad. Hold on. We're gonna stuff Laura down this hole. You think a human could fit there? And she's gonna yeah, Laura can. And we're gonna stuff her in there. Oh wow, it's really pulling in good, guys. <laughs> Whoa, I can hardly breathe in here. What? Uh, well of course you can hardly breathe, Joe. <laughs> oh, so we're gonna stuff her in there and she's gonna, she's gonna clean out the, the ducks for us as she goes down. That's how we do it here. It's called Italian style, right? The Italian style. Italian style. Italian style, yes. So uh, there's Joe climbing the ladder. Doing a mighty fine job, man. I've, I've been holding it for him the whole time. And watch him now. Now that I'm not holding it for him, watch him fall. You would feel really bad. I would feel bad. You can't let your best buddy fall, you know what I mean? It's not good. I'll laugh about it. It'll be a funny joke after I. That's okay. I'm not dressed nice today. I don't know why. Um. Another story. Um, it was it was it was clean and um, yeah, this shirt's not very. I mean, it's you know I I just I, I clean up nice, you know what I mean. But it's, we're, we're painting today, so it's not exactly the best day to. Uh, but um, there's Joe. Yeah, look at Joe. This is a cool shot here. Look, you can see Joe up up just back and into what he's painting. Isn't that neat? Are you looking at his butt? I'm not looking at his butt, even though he does have a nice butt. Sorry, ladies, he's taken. Jay, you have to cut something. I have no idea what you have to cut. I didn't hear anything, but okay. Uh, so here we go in here. Let's see. Laura's been busy at work on this area. I think Bree has too, but Laura's been busy at work on this yeah, area. She's doing all the cutting. I have to go do a second call in the office if you want to come hang out. Yeah, we're, gonna, we're, gonna, we're getting dirty here. We're, going, we're getting dirty. Going to do a second coat. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you put plenty of plastic down because you don't want to ruin what you worked so hard to buy, which is your house with your nice, with your nice. Floor. This is called Larva Tally Raw here, guys. This is Larva Tally Raw. Yeah. Raw and uncooked. Yeah. I'm a very good painter. Very good painter. Yeah, bro. You do a good job. I appreciate that. The trick is, the trick is, is what I've been taught, and it works really well, is not to do stripes up and down because look what happens. If you do like this. Yep. And like this, you see lines. Oh. So you have to paint kind of in a V shape. You see what I'm doing? I like that. Making like a V, that gets rid of any line. And then, whenever you have hardly anything on your brush or your roller, you kind of go over the whole thing to soak up any excess blobs. Yeah. So guys, in other words, paint in V's, not in lines. That's in, that's all. All right, so this is how we did it. This I hope you guys like our furnishings. This is a nice table we got. It's very nice. This is, Laura, we have a lot of debate. This is our permanent table for the kitchen. And Laura's never gonna cook again. She decided yeah, that the, 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 the Japanese place was so good. Is it's that crab rangoons? Yeah. Crab rangoons? Yeah. Nobody told me we got crab rangoons. They're angry at crab rangoons. They're angry. Of course we did. What makes them angry, Mike? That's it, look at this. This is looking quality, this is a quality job over here. Quality job, and the only quality that's happening around here is from Bree, I'm sorry. Everybody else, you guys aren't that good. <laughs> sorry, bro. Everybody's good. Everybody's good. And yet, look at this. She has blisters. Boom. So, all right, I'm gonna dig in. It's been interesting. We got the Sperry here, in case we need to trace any wires. Mike, I'll show you this. This is really cool. We'll do it later on. Sound good? Good. Okay, family room is done, except for that little piece above the window. There's like some tape on it. Um, the previous owners had some tape on that, so we have to kind of steam it off and then paint that, but here it is. All the cutting in was done beautifully. 
over there we still have to do, but Joe has to build. He can't reach that with the ladder, so he has to build like a like a little box that goes on top of each step so that he can kind of reach. What do you think, babe? I think it looks great. I need to find a great for that. Thanks. So, oh, this thing is getting orange. So now we are just um, going to head out of here. So I've come to the conclusion that I, until we get our stuff out of here, I'm not going to worry about the house being a wreck because not that it's a wreck, but there's just, I, because I'm, I haven't really been home, I've been just kind of having a hard time keeping everything organized and uh, keeping my sanity. So I decided to just let it go <laughs> until, um, because we plan on pretty much being moved out of here in a week or so out of here, like being moved out of here, uh, like our bedroom stuff, our kitchen stuff, like our upstairs kitchen stuff and um, uh, Joe's office probably by the end of the weekend this weekend coming up so I'm just not gonna worry about it because I was literally like I like things in place I like things organized I like when everybody everything has a home I like when things are clean but I'm making myself crazy you guys and um, now we are I'm just so we're so excited am I right Bob <clears throat> we're so excited but I also think that's like um I'm excited I can't wait to have everything done but when is it going to be done? Because <laughs> I'm someone that is very impatient and I don't like chaos. I don't like things like that. So I just want to work and do whatever we can to get our stuff in there soon. We have some friends that want to help us. Tomorrow we're going to go visit the baby. Oh, tomorrow we're going to go see Dominic, by the way, at 1 o'clock. So oh, I can't take it. Uh, Kate's been sending me pictures of the baby. He gets cuter every day, and Nate put, makes like a little mohawk on his head. It's so, so cute. So we're really excited to go see him tomorrow, and then we'll go straight to the house after that to do some more painting and more painting and more painting. And then some people, um, I know some people will ask, why don't you hire someone to paint? Because I'm nuts, and I like to do everything myself. <laughs> Am I right, babe? It's a bonding experience. It's just like I... Painting is not difficult. We've painted a lot. We've painted this place twice. We kind of have a thing that we do whenever someone we know, we, whenever someone gets a new place, I know. we all jump in. And we all jump in. We and thank, I mean, Mike and Brie are our saviors, especially Brie with her cutting in because she's got a very precise hand. Um, and we're getting it done. And it's also something like if we can do it ourselves, we'd rather do it ourselves than just... Um, kind of not waste money on hiring someone to do something if we can do it ourselves. That's always been our mentality. That's just how we roll. Spirit. It's the entrepreneur spirit. And I don't know how he's sane, by the way, because between work things that he's dealing with and meetings and stuff like that, phone call, type of phone call. And well, we better get this vlog up. I know. We gotta get this vlog up because I know you guys are waiting and I'm so sorry for keeping you, but um, give this video a thumbs up and send us some love and some words of encouragement because I'm feeling like, when is this going to be done? But um, and we're sorry that we haven't uploaded this any earlier, but um, we just haven't really... I don't know where I've been. Hold on, let me put you on top of my thing here real quick. Don't fall. Maybe you can see me, maybe you can't. I'm just putting my hoodie on. And we are about to be out of here. My dad's going to come see the house. So... You're missing out if you're not watching, if you're not tuning in on Saturday for...